I'm so glad to be back in the South where people are real. Oh, and the men are beautiful. Yes. Because I was forced to move to New York because of success. And I hate that place. I hate that place. I hate that place. I hate it. I hate it, okay? You're not allowed to say that. You're not allowed to say you hate New York. Because people will go, what do you mean you hate New York? It's the greatest city on earth. <laughs> what? And they always do it the same way. They always look slightly off to the side like a cult member. It's the greatest city on earth. <laughs> what? Where'd you go? I'm right here. What happened? Is de Blasio paying you? What's going on? <laughs> I hate that place. It's a Yankee trash heap. I hate it. <laughs> this is my purpose in life. This is my ministry to tell you. It's horrible. Because when they say to you, it's the greatest city on earth, I go, prove it. Like, oh, uh, uh, the museums, what? The museums, the, muse the museums are amazing. You can go to a museum every day. I can't go to no museum every day, I got a job. Well, well the restaurants, the restaurants are amazing. I can't go to your fancy restaurants, quit my job to go to museums. And it's so cold. <laughs> and just to know something about me, just emotionally, spiritually, genetically, historically, I'm never supposed to be cold. <laughs> so to live somewhere that gets so cold. <laughs> like last year, it snowed, there was a blizzard, but they called it a bomb cyclone. A cyclone is a hurricane in the South Pacific, and a bomb is a damn bomb. <laughs> Why are we all of a sudden confused as to what's happening out here? <laughs> so it happened on a Wednesday, and they told me I still had to go to work. Wait a minute. There's frozen on the water on the ground. Jesus don't want me to go to work. <laughs> Why I got to do this? What are you talking about, okay? And they're like, oh, you can still take the train. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. It was seven degrees outside. As the high. Those were all the degrees we was gonna get that day. <laughs> and you want me to get on this train? I live where the above ground train is. I don't know what these frigid temperatures do to rail lines. I was a theater major, not an engineer. <laughs> So I get on this frozen train and it jumps the tracks and all of a sudden I'm in a Final Destination movie. Absolutely not. <laughs> so I was like, fine, I'll take a car. And I was standing outside in the seven degrees freezing my eggs. <laughs> trying to get to work and I snapped because it was seven degrees outside, but the sun was out. <laughs> mocking me like a lamp in the damn sky. <laughs> and I snapped, I just looked up, I'm like, I get a billion degrees, you can't give me 50, go to hell! And I was like, you know what? <laughs> then I realized I was a black lady in a white neighborhood yelling at the sun. <laughs> I was like, you know what, let me go inside, because if you call the cops on me, I earned it. I earned it. <laughs> you show up like, officer, please take me somewhere warm. <laughs> I hate this place. Because the thing is, I'm not supposed to be here. Black people! We not supposed to be here. <laughs> Suffering through, through scarves and hats and boots and gloves, no. We supposed to be in West Africa with sandals on eating mangoes. That's what we supposed to be. <laughs> Instead of suffering with these melanin lacking bastards. It's too cold, man. There's too many humans in New York. There's too many humans. Eight and a half million people live in 300 square miles. Why? <laughs> if you break that down, that's 27,000 people per mile. How do you live? 
Whose idea was this? <laughs> y'all just strapped two islands together with some bridges and was like, oh, y'all got to see this now. <laughs> and God forbid one of these Yankees finds out I'm not from New York. Oh, you're not from New York? They all sound like witches to me. You're not from New York? <laughs> What do you mean you're not from New York? No, through the grace of God, I was not born here. Thank you. <laughs> Where are you from? Atlanta, you're welcome. <laughs> like, oh, you must be so glad to be in New York. The South is so racist. The South is so racist. Oh, you mean the part of the South that starts in Canada and ends at Mexico? <laughs> part of America that's not racist. I'll move today. <laughs> I'll wait. <laughs> I know the North is more racist because in the North, they split up white folks. They got Italian neighborhoods, Irish neighborhoods. I live in a Greek neighborhood. You know what Irish and Italian and Greek is in the South? White! <laughs> Nobody has time to break down your brand of whiteness, okay? I don't care what flag your Caucasian flies under, Brandon. Go vote and sit the hell down. What do you want from me?